No, bah, bloody hell, okay. TF2 just out here wilding. Me thinking, oh, we're gonna have to wait to the end of the month. They bloody just dropped Scream 4 just 2019 just right now. I also work with this bloody drop. So I've had to bloody be brushing home trying to get bloody ready for this. TF2 is updating as I'm recording this. You know, it gives me a bit of time to talk about what's new. And then we're gonna do some uh, look at some items and stuff. So yeah, it's gonna be fun. Stick around. I'm really excited for Scream Fortress 2019. Featuring two new community maps, Laughter and Pre Pre Precipice. I almost said Prejudice. I'm thinking of Blizzard. Added the Spooky Spores case. Contains 22 new community cosmetic items that make up the Spooky Spores collection. And also has a chance to give one of five new community created Halloween restricted items as a bonus item. Bonus ducks! As well as an unusual fire for your taunts. If you remember, last year for Christmas, I got a flipping awesome unusualizer and that was flipping awesome if I do say so myself. So they've added 20 new unusual effects, 12 new effects for hats and 8 for taunts. Fucking hell they're out here wowed in. Jesus Christ Valve. 20. Fucking 20 and hopefully we can see what those are and see how they look. I think they're gonna be fucking cool. All players who launch the game will receive a soul guard goal if they don't have one already. Obviously I have one. And I remember someone in the comments was asking me if they were going to get one. So yes, if you're watching this video, you should now have one. Grants access to Miraz missions and Halloween item transmutations and tracks Miraz missions and completed and souls collected. All contracts have been reset, allowing them to be completed again. Hell yes, I'm going to have fun doing that. Completing Halloween contract will give players a classic Halloween item and a chance for a spooky spoils case. Very nice. To continue last year's event by collecting souls of dead players for your soul gargoyle by killing enemies, yada yada yada. All cases will grant Halloween 2019 unusual effects instead of their normal unusual effects during the event. So any cosmetic crate ad uh, unlocked, you get your own fucking, you get your own unusual effects for 2019. Hell yeah. I feel like there are going to be some sick effects because obviously we had that community particle thing happening. So I'm hopefully some of them got accepted for Halloween because there were some pretty cool cosmetic effects there. Uh, during Halloween matches, yep, and it runs until November 7th. This is, I think this is a late, later one than usual, lasting a bit longer, and then some general fixes not really related to Halloween, such as fix an overheal bug, and players teleport into the underworld, uh, fixed being able to attack players with a short circuit during truce, fix the snack attack for not playing a timer sound, updated Carnival of Carnage to fix an area where engineers could build outside the world, updated, updated the localization files, hell yeah boys, wouldn't be a TF to update without that, would it? But yes, it just dropped out of the blue, and I was fucking blown away. So yeah, let's let's jump into it. Hopefully, it's it's ready. Okay, we're in game, and I've already seen some of the items just by you know my eyes wandering, and I'm very happy. So we're gonna start from the bottom with the case exclusives, then go up blue, purple, pink, etc. So we have the wild whip, a still tail, and the remorseless raptor. I feel like this might be for demo because of you know demo and rappy. Eye engineer, very nice. Avian Amant for the spy. I said why would spy be a raven in my last TF2 video and uh, well here it is. And the pyro shark. They fucking added it. Hell yeah. I'm hopefully going to get that. Derangement garment. Pretty nice. That's like a straight jacket I think. Fuel injector. Quite nice. Mad Max-esque. Party poncho for the pyro. Looks like a cosmetic we already have so I'm not feeling that but to each their own. Pocket Halloween boss. I like that. Hopefully it has different styles but we already have the headless horseman so maybe not the binoculars yes we can finally make cursed cursed pyro hell yeah that's what i'm about the candy cranium interesting design i don't really frick with that el mustacho i do frick with that and the name is epic got the bat hat it's just a bat hat you know convict cap yeah bread biter i like that that looks like it might be like um one of these things you know like a like a face mask kind of thing el zap Petito! I, I fucked that up, didn't I? Uh, Voodoo Vizier, that's quite nice. Reminds me of Baron Samdi from Shmai! Soviet Strongman. Is that just one arm? One slightly muscular arm? Skullbrero, I like that. That is that is a nice design, actually. That's pretty cool. Horrible Horns, as, as one does. And the Madman's Muzzle, to go with the uh, straight jacket set. The Trick Stabber, <laughs> that's quite nice as well. I like that. Elizabeth the Third. There was something about Elizabeth the Third on that 4chan leak. I mean, obviously most of this stuff isn't isn't. It's just been debunked by this update. But that was mentioned. I remember that being mentioned. So that's pretty dank. 
Head of the Dead for the Pyro, another Pyro Skull themed cosmetic. This time it's like a. It's a do you call them Sugar Skulls? Like, I can't quite remember. The Rackman, obviously for Soldier, you know, Lieutenant Bites. The Pyro Lantern, eh, he looks like he's got um, many, many tumours, but th that's what it might be. That might be the lore behind the item. And then Mr. Bones, you know, his nice little uh, dapper. Dapper Happer. Right, so basically, it's the same design as last year's Scream Fortress case. As you can see, this one's violet. I think the other one, this one's blue. Yeah, this one's blue and that. So yeah, basically all they all look the same. And it doesn't phase me because all cosmetic cases look the same now, and uh, war paints all look this. We didn't get a war paint case actually. That's something. We didn't. We didn't get one of these. I know. I remember. Remember unlocking some of these last time, but yeah, we didn't get any. The annual Scream Fortress unboxing. Will we get anything good? Probably not. That, that's the way this thing goes. You'd never get anything good, but we're just going to go for it anyway, you know? Look at the draw. Let's see what we're getting in our first case. We got two items. Oh shit, we got the one I said I didn't really want. Well, hey, and... Yeah! We fucking did it, boys. We got the Pyro Shark. Oh, that's actually a decent unbox, not gonna lie. That's fucking class. Uh, okay, so we did that side. We're going to do this side now. Yep. Okay, come on, what we get him, what we get him? Two items again, ho ho! Ooh, okay. Stat changer. Three. The raptor tail and... The strong arm. Sound, sound, okay, yeah, that's fair. I thought we got an unusual fire, I was like, yo, what the fuck? But no, okay, we Gucci. Okay, so we're going to hit the middle one up, you know? See what we get in this one. No twimes in this one, unfortunately. The... I don't know, the candy head thing? Oh shit, that's a strange, okay. So yeah, we don't know if it's gonna be like an unusual or anything, we just... We just know it's gonna be, yeah, uh, okay, interesting, alright. Boom. Boom. Penultimate case, what we get him, what we get him, come on. Come on! Yes! Solid, alright, we've got the items we wanted, really. You know, I wanted them, we got them. Secured the bag. Let's go. Cursed loadouts. Here we come. Okay, last case. Give me something good. Come on. No second item, but it's the straight jacket. Okay, that's a decent looking cosmetic. Didn't really want it, but you know what? It's decent. Okay, it's decent, right? It's not the best, but it's all right. And now we're just gonna hop onto Pyro. Check out. Yep, he's a zombie right now. We can change that. Oh yeah. Oh, that is that is sick. I do like that. I'm I'm a big fan of that. Look at it. Look at his toothy grin. That is amazing. All right, and uh, where is it? I didn't actually have the other poncho, so maybe maybe that's a good thing. It's not even here. It's not even gonna be a pyro item, is it? I'm just gonna be like, oh, it's just one we already have, but then it won't be for pyro. It'll be like for soldier or some shit. Oh, it is soldier. Never mind. I take it. I take everything back. I said about this cosmetic. It's, it's all right, you know. <laughs> Hell yeah. Uh, for scout, because he's already wearing some glasses. We're just. <laughs> oh, that is. Oh, I forgot I zoom in. Mouse two. Shit. <laughs> That's amazing. Fucking hell. <laughs> I love that cosmetic. Oh shit, we have styles for it as well. That's amazing, I love that. That's, I think that's my favourite cosmetic from the update, just as you'd expect really. I don't really frick with that, but these two. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Why are we still here? Just to suffer. It's amazing. Uh, what else did we get? It's this. Oh, it's for Scout, not for Demo. Okay. Uh, guess we'll stick it on here. Sh sure. I mean, it's a cosmetic. It's a dinosaur cosmetic. That's that's a win in my book. I, I see this as an absolute win. I, I see this as an absolute win. Uh, what else we got? Heavy strongman arm. Strange for some reason. Fair. I'll probably have to get rid of that for this. Boom. Oh. Oh, it's both arms. That's that's good. Class. Alright, what else did we get? Medic, medic, cosmetic, medic, cosmetic. 
Yeah, we've seen all these. Okay. Medic. Oh. Medic. And there we go. Okay, class. So those are the new cosmetics we got, and now we're just going to do a transmutation. Just why not? going to get rid of the cosmetics I don't really frick with. I'm just going to do one to end off this video on a sort of note. And I'll show you how transmutations work, because if you haven't got a gargoyle, you won't know, and this will be a nice little way to find out. I think mine's on the max level. Proud. That doesn't really do anything, just changes the colour. So you need three, three items. Any of these ones will do. I have 21 pages. So we're we don't really frick with and use those. Uh, name, can't really fill that in. We're just going to a YMCA, which is where Morasmus lives. Let's, let's go. Okay, uh, da, 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 fucking, you, that says VK, whatever. Alright, boys. Uh, Solid, you know. It, you gotta do what it says on the uh, on the letter. Okay, guys. <laughs> All right, let's go. Well, we get him. Oh hell yeah! I already have one of them, <laughs> but hell yeah! It's gonna be unusual, isn't it? No, <laughs> no, it's not. I'm not gonna record my reaction face cam to this. I'm just gonna watch them and kind of give my give my. Uh, thoughts on these. This is by Delphi, you know, he sometimes makes good content. Oh, sh this one's quite nice. I like the uh, little effects within the effects, like Monoculus, the Soul Gargoyle, Marasmus, very nice. Got some bubbles in there as well, that's quite nice, quite nice. And then another recolor, but this time it's Abyssal Aura, quite nice. Wicked Woods, okay, that's always got a little ghost, it's like, oh, quite, I like that, I like the blue colour scheme. Ooh, Mystical Medley, this one's nice. I'm, I'm very enthusiastic about this one, NG. I agree. This is a very woohoo moment. Ethereal Essence, that's, that's alright, but not really a fan of that. You're spoiling us. This one's quite nice as well. Right, that's where I'm going to end this video here. This has been Stream Forge 2019. We've got new maps. I'm going to do a video playing those another time. You know, got to ring this thing for views. But no, I'm fully, fully looking forward to Scream Fortress. And uh, yeah. Have a great day. Peace out. Hey, oh, uh, uh, I've been up for like two hours. Two hours. Yo, bitch can food took a few showers. Few showers. I don't buy my just money dance. Yeah. That wristwatch costs a hundred grand.